The bail application of six people accused of Muti murders in KwaZulu-Natal has been postponed till next week. Authorities have moved the application to a court 100 kilometers away amid growing concerns over the safety of the accused, the prosecutor and the investigating officers. The six are accused of butchering young girls for their body parts. Police could barely cope last week as hundreds of angry protesters gathered outside the Umbumbulu Magistrate's Court, eager to get their hands on the alleged Muti killers. This time around, police were not taking any chances. Protesters handed over a petition opposing bail and threatened to take the law into their own hands if bail is granted. Authorities have now decided to move the matter a hundred kilometers away to the Pinetown Magistrate's Court. The six suspects are accused of murdering nine women, mutilating their bodies and dumping them in nearby fields. Police believe Sangoma Abigail and Japa ordered the women killed in order to use their body parts for muti. It was here that the alleged mastermind Abigail Njapa brewed her muti. The 63-year-old Sangoma allegedly used various body parts, including ears, breasts and even genitals, supplied by her alleged accomplices. Njapa wept silently during today's brief hearing. Her alleged accomplices may not be identified as they still have to take part in a police ID parade. Investigating officers say they're still hunting for more bodies. Vanessa Governor, E-News, Umbumbulu.